The easiest of all is number 75. If we add these two, you will see easily that they are x components because they are the same value and at the same angle, their x components cancel each other out or balance each other out when we end up with two vertical components added together. So if I look at this, this is a 45 degree angle. So it's 60 newtons, not 60 degrees, 60 newtons times, and it's sine or cosine, which since, you know, to, to be consistent, if this right here is 45, this is 45. So therefore, for my vertical component, I will use sine. So 60 sine of 45, and there's two of them added together. So you end up with 120 sine of 45 degrees. So it's 60 roots of 2, which is 60 roots of 2. times roots of 2, that's 85 newtons. So that's the net force. What is the weight of the light? 85 newtons. Because the two of them, the two cables providing, each providing half of those 85, added up to 85, since they ask, ask not for the specific force in each, they ask for the resultant force, once we found that resultant force as the two components vertical added together amounting to 85 newtons that will be the force 85 newtons which is force of gravity or weight of the light that's your answer right there very short very sweet very easy the only thing if you are to obey sig fig rules because they gave us three sig figs to begin with this answer is 84.9 newtons. There. That's it.